Motown baby going crazy like the 80s. 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 I put it on the floor and I dare bitch to take it. Niggas running around the city. Owe me money, shit is silly. Buy my money just like 50 hoes. Mad I got the power in the juice. Nah, been talking shit. I'm calling 48219. First, I like to do it, you know, in the middle. Yeah. But I gotta ask. Uh, the whole thing that went viral with you and your song, you know what I'm saying, Dripping 101. Mm, yeah. And you was out there with the kids, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It was it was hype for you too. <laughs> yeah. Just give me like the the backstory on that a little bit. Like how did everything take place? Like, cause it, of course the caption say, you know, fired. Yeah. So soon as you go out there, you nigga going yeah. crazy, you know what I'm saying? Shooting yeah. the video and shit. So kinda like touching that a little bit. Um, at the end of the day, once you don't work in the, work somewhere no more, mm -hmm. all bets are off. I don't know, and I'm not, some people, like, have their opinions, but I'm not fucked up about nothing. I've been working since since work was work, you know? Like, <laughs> yeah, sure. you know how many jobs I did live and got fired? You know, you know what I'm saying? Like, and not because I did something, because I'm saying, I don't care when I was 17 working at the movie, so I'm not tripping. Like, you you always have to move on, like, but I'm an educated black woman, so I'm not worried about that. Mm -hmm. But when I um dropped back in, like, October, because I really haven't dropped no single last year or like all year mm. until like the like October. So you know my kids going to homecoming. That's my homecoming time and stuff like that. Mm. With Detroit Rap Daily posting me, mm. it went viral in the school too. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. uh and most time baby did good. Like was mm -hmm. dripping on But it went good. So that right there it stands from um I had to have a conversation with my students too because it was something new to them. I'm mm. always on Detroit Rap Daily mm. because because I was new to this school and this district. Y'all don't know me, mm. so once you see somebody like, hey, I see you, like yeah, sure. it hit different. You mm. know what I'm saying? So it was a different experience for them. But I never engaged in them. They didn't know until I went viral for yeah, real. Yeah. Which and I don't even feel like I went viral. I'm always on there. It's yeah. just y'all didn't know me yeah. and never seen me in person, so it just hit different. You're like, oh, this is really my teacher. Miss, yeah. yeah, and but soon as I was like, I seen y'all little faces. I had blocked all of them mm -hmm. because I still knew. <laughs> It was my job though like you know mm -hmm. and i had told them like at the end of the day this is about y'all mm -hmm. us coming monday through friday i said nobody in this world see me as much as y'all do mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying i'm here for y'all helping y'all get to a goal and that's for y'all to get y'all diploma and no matter what you want to be in this world this the, the high school is step one for everybody for sure. no matter if you're a doctor if you want to be a podcast you want to be a rival well, majority of everybody at least got to this no, step yeah, this yeah, is yeah. what i'm going to help you do mm -hmm. i'm the first person in my family to go to college to have a dream to even think about just being something for myself so nobody can determine me from what I got going on. For sure. Then I had a meeting, the first meeting, it was just like the, a, a parent wished to stay anonymous and she felt as if I was a bad influence on her kid because mm. she came across my social media. Mm. If you don't like it, block me. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's, you know yeah, yeah for sure. I, and I, I, when I'm in a meeting, the first meeting, I didn't say not one word. I was just listening. I don't have to talk. All I have to do is just listen. Yeah. So I never initiated. They said I wasn't in trouble. This was just a warning, but I'm like, Warning me of what? I feel like you just let me know something. Mm -hmm. This is not a warning. This you just let me know what a parent thinks. Mm -hmm. So <clears throat> it was just, it was, I won teacher of the month in December. Mm -hmm. I won teacher of the month and I knew it was about to be like something crazy because like uh, administration came in, but they came in my room like soon as the bell rang. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So yeah, you know, didn't waste you no know time, black man. folks, like you read the room. Yeah, for administration sure. never came in my room that late. <laughs> you know, they was like, yeah, they want you to delete your content. Oh, ooh, ooh. the parent, uh, she still called it. Woo, woo, woo. And it was, it was so much going on because I just won teacher of the month. I'm reading all it. I'm just like, I didn't know what was going on, mm -hmm. but you can read that. I got, I still got, probably got it in the car. Didn't I read it to you? Like uh, she is an icon. She's the only one that care about. She don't even listen. She don't want to come to our game. She don't want to cheer for yeah. us. She do like, it was just so much stuff. Somebody said, y'all should have been gay. That girl that award. Y'all know y'all did her wrong. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, it, yeah. it's, it's natural. It's just, it's just a natural ability me for me to love on people and do certain things. And mm -hmm. I said, had that parent come in the classroom and watch me teach, come to my girl club, exactly. come to parent teacher conference. Mm -hmm. I got 125 students, 10 parents came to parent teacher conference i gotta I, it don't matter what i do y'all don't be there mm -hmm. when i do it, it y'all yeah. never there it be me i be the only adult around yeah, yeah, yeah like yeah, so sure. everything that i do y'all never there so come see me teach come really see me in that professionalism that you say i don't have yeah, you're gonna change your whole outlook school yeah. was from seven to three you saying yeah. i can't do nothing else <laughs> <Is that> <laughs> <laughs> It's only even seven to three. Yeah. Would you <laughs> and I need, I need, I, I'm just sorry because this was irritating me. I need a teacher that's going to um, lesson plan. Woo, 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 woo. If you're a real teacher, you do that in the summertime, baby. I mm -hmm. do 16, I do a 16 week lesson plan in the summertime. So I got to do it with school. Why? Because I need to focus on them. For sure, and see yeah. where they at and yeah. do that type you put, of thing. Get your shit together. What are you talking about? I, this is why I love being a teacher. I got the whole summer to plan. Get this, when I school do start, I got my whole plan. And all I got to do is give the instruction. Mm -hmm. It's called structural design, folks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, for sure. Like, yeah. if you would have seen this, like, or knew this was going to happen, would you would have, like, 
Oh shoot! It's a little mouthful. Want to get that for you? Yes. <laughs> keep that. Keep that. <laughs> That's real shit. But no, would you would have changed anything, or you just like fuck it? This is me. Um, this is what you gonna get. Man, like. I wish, like, y'all could have been there and, like, actually see the influence and impact. And, like, and if you didn't see, like, my caption that I wrote, it's not about job placement. I want people to know the real impact and influence that I have. Well, my kids don't even care about me rapping. Mm -hmm. They didn't know. Yeah. When I'm in school, they ask me, what does entice me? What does monopoly mean? What does I teach U.S. history. Okay. I'm a black woman. I wear uh, Martin Luther King and Malcolm X shirts and Black Lives Matter and Trayvon yeah. Martin shirts to work every day. Mm -hmm. Like... I'm at work working, teaching them about the history. When y'all was on strike, doing all that, I'm saying, hey, can y'all send me some videos about y'all strike so I can teach my kids this? Because right now we're doing labor unions. Mm -hmm. I'm really talking to the community to come back, give me information so I can teach them. Like, mm -hmm. I'm teaching between seven and yeah, three. For sure, for sure. You know, I don't, it, it doesn't matter what you say, or mm -hmm. I don't even remember what the question was. So I'm going to take it. I was saying, like, if you knew this, if you knew this outcome was going to take place, oh, you had no, such things I would up. No, because the love, listen. And I watch Better Rose too. Like, you can't copy respect. Real sure. shit. I yeah. mean, I'm so sorry because my kids watch it. I don't know what to do. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> you can't copy respect, real love, real influence. Like, I really do really good things. Yeah. After Valentine's Day, I got everybody something. The teachers, well, they, they like, oh my God, I wish we can really get back to this. Like, I do stuff people re really wish they could. Mm -hmm. That's just love on people. Tell everybody they look beautiful. I okay, get everybody one. Boys, yeah. girls, everything. You the mm -hmm. go. You this. Act like... I wouldn't change anything. On my last day, they had rose petals down my students when I walked. I was crying. I looked messed up yeah. and bold in the video. I was crying the yeah. whole day. Yeah. I cried to work. Like, this was real. Me and my student, we was crying. Like, mm. this was real for us. Mm -hmm. It was real for us. Mm -hmm. Like, and I was crying. I ain't brushed my hair. They, my kids picking me up like, Miss Brown, it's okay. Right. They trying to make me feel. I, I'm just looking at them. I was breaking down. Yeah, yeah. Like, it was It was very, it felt like a funeral that day. For sure. And you, I could tell just by your conversation, you passionate about the yeah. kids. Yeah. You know what I'm saying?